Marston. You look like you have a fine appetite, madam. Well, oh. you shot me. Mr. Marston. Absolutely shot Hello. Madam, what afflicts you so terribly? Mr. Marston, why do you want to talk to me that way? I know you're a married man. At least you have a fine behind, madam. That's some grand cleavage, madam. My lord, mister, I can't believe you thought that was an appropriate comment. It wouldn't kill you to show a bit of leg. You must I won't know stupid, Marston. you know. You shouldn't keep the merchandise so hidden from the customer, you know? You have no respect at all. You've got to help. Come on, give me a smile. I won't fight, although you might like it if I did. Just the name of you make me wish I wasn't oh. a married man. Oh, yes, I know about that. You kiss your mama with that lips? You're enough to give a man adulterous thoughts. That's quite a thing. You'd be beautiful if both your eyes looked in the same direction. How rude. You need a proper lesson. If only I had time to teach it. Mmm, yeah. I'm gonna remember you for later. That's some oh, grand really? cleavage, madam. You ought to wash that mouth out with some Crick's family style. It wouldn't kill you to show a bit of leg. You could try to appear a little less desperate, madam. I think you forgot to shave, madam. Hey, mister. Is there anything of yours you'd like to stick into something of mine? <laughs> I don't think so. Do you still like nature, despite what it did to you? If you have money, you can talk to me like that all day. Well, it can be